you revealed something about you revealed a few things about the second season. Now, yeah. what can you tell us? What can you share? Uh, well, I, I'd like to say <coughs> I'd like to say I'm the first person actually uh, revealing a lot of it, but I'm not. Uh, I, I hate saying it because I'm a spoiler folk. But uh, Rush does discover the bridge of the ship. Uh, Eli gets a little bit of love in this year. Nice. My favorite story. That. <laughs> and uh, I guess you can't really tell. So you said it's not Chloe, though. It's not Chloe. It comes from an unexpected place. But my favorite thing about it is it's. Well, first of all, you know the, the Chloe thing isn't over. You know it's not going to end anytime soon. That's a long-term thing. But right. that's always been an unrequited thing. I mean, after after she met Scott, the very unrequited is that. What do you? I mean, what do you love about this character? Because it's, I think it's a fan favorite from what I've seen. I mean, I know personally, I always look forward to you know the Eli plotline. So, oh god, no what, pressure there. Yeah. So, I mean, what do you love about the character? What's what's your favorite part? I mean, it was always the goal from the beginning that, that Eli would be, for lack of a better term, the surrogate. Yeah. And if we've accomplished any minute aspect of that, that's that's the truth. That's the thing. It's, it's not. It's not hard to relate to anyone. Right. You know, it makes sense. You understand where he's coming from. You understand his feelings. Uh, the first time he sees a Stargate, his reaction is the way that I'd react the first time I saw a Stargate. You know, first time going through one, I would hold my breath. If I was going through <laughs> one. That's why you like all his breath. Um, he's just real. And, and these days, you need somebody you can identify with. Right. And what uh, what's it like interacting with such a huge cast? Because it really is a, a stellar, huge cast. It's it's intimidating when I first heard. I mean, even Robert Carlyle getting attached, I was intimidated, and I screen tested with him. Right. Uh, and then Blue Diamond and Big Nog came on later. But in the end, it's kind of. I think it's gotten. It's better because we've become this really cool family. Like, right. On set and off, you know, we're cooking for each other and having dinners and playing rock band every night at my house. Uh, just as much as we're on set, talking about our lives. And it makes it more comfortable as an actor. Right. Because you, you feel like you can play freedom to just do what you want. And even more than that, everyone's really supportive and fun. And it's a, I'm kind of I'm selfish, but it's actually a blast. I have fun. There are days where we'll be sitting around chatting, making each other laugh, pissing off the entire crew. <laughs> and I'll, I'll say out loud, like, guys, we're getting paid right now. And they'll just kind of have this moment of, oh, God, like, it's, it's great. It's great. So, last question, what's your favorite episode from the first season? I'd like to say it was harder. <coughs> harder to say, but, uh, sorry, I just sort of Star Fox walked by and I freaked out, sorry. <laughs> um, my favorite episode is Hand Down Time. Yeah. Uh, it, was, it was one that, when they emailed it to us and I read it, I immediately emailed Robert Cooper who wrote it and said, this is amazing, I can't wait to do it. And that was just we did. Right. And shooting it, you know, I got to do a lot of that. Anything from Eli's point of view, I did the camera work. So that was, I get to be a camera off. Guns, explosions, things down, it rained on. Like, it was just it was kind of like all those kid fantasies of being an action hero. And at the same time, you knew you were doing a good episode. Right. Even doing it, we knew we were doing something really, really cool. And I have to say that there's some great episodes in season two, like that uh, Cloverdale, specifically, just one of those that you're just going to kind of, people are going to be talking about that. Very cool. Thank you very much. Thank you.